Okay, we're gonna take the seatbelts out. Hopefully. This video is sponsored by Nomad Internet. Don't forget to go check them out and use discount code CrystalVanner25. Please be reminded, this channel does not produce content for those under 18. All right, so I couldn't get the seatbelts out. Um, it's beyond my muscle strength. So the BF is gonna help me and I hope that his drill is also stronger than mine and we can get these seatbelts out. I was going to leave a couple of them under the um, uh, couch bed for when I have someone, you know, over and where I'm driving somewhere, but I've decided I want them out, just completely out. They are old, um, they're a little bit uh, dry rotted, and the bolts are rusted, and so I just don't want them in. I'm not going to replace them. I'm not going to do anything with them. Um, I'm not going to worry about having seatbelts on this couch bed. I can ride one other person safely in the passenger seat. And uh, I've ridden in people's RVs and on their couch or dinette area, not buckled in. So it is what it is. So I'm going to take those out. And uh, that way we can get it vacuumed real good from the carpet that's under here. And then when the couch bed gets put, put back in order, it will be good to go good to go so I am going to eventually do a little more painting but I'm not going to paint all the way to the floor the paneling is in kind of bad condition down there and it's peeling and stuff uh, it looks like at some point it had gotten wet and we just hosed the windows because um, he was hosing down his bike again from the pollen and no leaks showed up here so I guess at some point maybe this window was open and and um, water got under this um, window and so that's why the paneling under the window was wet this top window in the loft was opened and that did leak a little of course of course, an airplane comes when I'm filming. Of course. Not even gonna edit that out. I hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> anyway, um, I think my curtain and how far down I plan on painting painting will be fine, even when it's in bed mode. You won't be able to see that part of the wall. I just don't want to paint all the way down. That wall is not in good condition. So let's get the seatbelts out. <laughs> okay, so basically we have to cut the seatbelts out because there are bolts underneath that is I'm not climbing under there <laughs> he's not climbing under there and I want to get rid of the seat belts and it's not like anything's going to be stored under here anyway so we're just going to get rid of the straps um, I guess I could put something some valuables back here if I wanted to but the only way to access them um, is to take the whole couch out so I wouldn't put anything here that I would need to get to so, oh, there's a screw. Good Lord. This is my gas tank fill. Open. I'm trying to cut as low as I can, but it's hard. There's wiring and hoses down here for this water tank. And fuel and water pump. They're all, they're all rusted. All the seat belts are rusted. They're all, I mean, they're probably with a good scrubbing, they would be okay. I don't, I don't feel like they would not save someone in an accident. But the chances of me riding someone on my couch are very slim. So, I can ride, like I said earlier, I can ride another passenger up front safely with the seat belt. I'm not going to worry about these. 
All right, well, that's the pile of seat belts. Um, there were two that I couldn't get super close. This one that's under the tank, I just cut it as close as I could. And the one over here by the wheel well, I couldn't get down as far as I got with this one and this one. I couldn't get that close. But anyway, um, in the next day or two, I will go vacuum it out real good to get this carpet real clean while I don't have the couch in my way. And then I'll clean all this dust out as best I can. And yeah, be ready to get the couch bed back in. Thanks for watching. Thanks for supporting. Be good to yourself. Be kind to others. And whatever you are doing, I hope you are enjoying it.